there guys and welcome back to another Forza Horizon 5 playthrough video on my channel. So if you watched last time we checked out some Horizon stories on Forza Horizon 5 to get ourselves some more accolades to hopefully be able to unlock some more Horizon Adventure chapters and therefore get to the Hall of Fame. Well I bring good news because over the la I'm past the couple of days when uh, when honest, I've been playing and um, recording some of the videos you've seen over the past couple of days, and also just playing um, myself, um, I've unlocked some more accolades, and I've unlocked two Horizon Adventure chapters, of which we only have two left. So we're now going to go and unlock the Titan, which is the grand finale of cross country racing, the longest cross country race. Couldn't agree more. We also get a thousand accolades for that, and another thousand accolades for locking all the cross country stuff. Um, so we only need 2,150 accolades to get the Hall of Fame Just invitation. Just got word you've approved construction on the Titan. Oh, this will be fun. Okay. Um, so if I pop back in here, we can now go and unlock the street scene, uh, and the finale of the street scene racing is the marathon. So that is everything unlocked. Ramiro was saying the same thing. I'll give him the go-ahead for the marathon. There it is. Horizon Mexico is complete. Ooh. How'd you feel? Couldn't have done it without you, Haley. <laughs> well, obviously, but I couldn't have done it without you either, superstar. Nice work. All right, enough messing around. Let's get you into this Hall of Fame, shall we? Back on the road. Let's do this. Hey, amigo. Gracias a ti, Horizon <laughs> Street Scene has never been bigger. Nice work, my friend. Sorry, I just had to let them talk though because I didn't want to miss anything. So, we need 150 accolades. So, we can pretty much do anything and get 150 accolades. And then we'll be invited to the Hall of Fame because we've unlocked everything in our Horizon Adventure chapter. We have nearly completed our last accolade bar after unlocking everything and um, we're pretty much done. So I am not going to go and do the marathon. I am instead going to go and get this bonus board um, which should get me 150 accolades I am hoping. Um, so I'm in my uh, Porsche Tycoon welcome pack. To do uh, so. Right, I'm just going to drive meters. over here. I'm not going to cut this bit out because it's literally just over here. Hopefully it won't be too difficult to find. There we go, I can see it now. I can see it right in front of me and I am so keen that I've just smacked into something. Turn around when it is safe to do so. Does that not get me any accolades, bro? Apparently that doesn't get me any accolades. Okay. So instead, I'm going to go and do this drag race, the Festival Drag Strip, um, which gets me 750 accolades, which is obviously 600 more than we actually need, so I'll see you there. Okay, so here we go, Festival Drag Strip in our Porsche Tycoon. Let's do this and let, let's get invited to the Hall of Fame. Oh my god, this feels, it feels really special actually, I'm not going to lie. Look how these M5s with Forza Aero are keeping up with me though, like bruh. I'm in a Porsche Taycan. Nearly 200 mile an hour across the line. If only it didn't do that closing down your screen. So 15.7 seconds, doesn't really matter what our time is because we get 750 accolades. We only need 150 to get invited to the Hall of Fame, so there you go. I am. Um, I will do a guide on how to get to the Hall of Fame by the way, so now I've got to it. I know definitely how to get to it, so I'll do a guide for you all if you haven't been following this series um, and if, you, if you've kind of mi um, not understood some things, I'll do a full guide, a simple breakdown on how you do it. What does but, our favourite superstar have to say about their name up in lights? I'm speechless. Actually, it's funny. You talk more than any other Horizon driver I've ever met. But you know what? I'll just say you're not finished yet. The festival playlist is full of exclusive rewards and drivers who'd give anything to line up against a legend like you. Okay, so... I think... I think you did it. Better get down here. You've made the Hall of Fame! In 200 metres... Right, so we've literally... Oh, 
Okay, fair enough. We didn't have to turn left. We have also Welcome got an achievement. 50 gamer scores. In Horizon history. But you know what? I'll just say you're not finished yet. The, the pork slice. Is for what a legendary gamer tag. Give anything to line up against a legend like you. You made it, but why stop there, right? Where to next? So, there you go then. We are now officially in the Hall of Fame. Um, it doesn't really add any kind of flair to our game attack, but you know, I mean, we might be able to do that, but I don't think we can. I haven't heard anybody talk about there being a special flair for being in the Hall of Fame, but you know. I'm just saying though, see this guy here was Sazju. He's on the maximum level. Uh, he's probably got a modded account, which unfortunately is still a thing. Um, and unfortunately cheaters are also still a thing, but there's nothing really much we can do about that. Um, hopefully Playground Games will fix it at some point, but there's no guarantees. So you're always going to have cheaters, um, but you've got a dude here who is three levels below me. He's obviously going to be legit. I have reached the Hall of Fame at level 57. I'm quite impressed with that. That's pretty early in the game. I've only got 5 million credits. I've, I've, I still haven't even got 100 cars yet, so I think it's quite good. We've done all of the stuff. We haven't completed all of the stuff, but we've unlocked all the stuff. And to be fair, we have actually completed quite a lot of it. We've done quite a lot of the showcases. We've done a couple of the finale races. I just want to have a quick look at this leaderboard. I don't mean to put you back straight away, but unlike some other halls of fame, ours is ranked. <laughs> Not going to let those other names be listed above yours, are you? Okay. So, surprise, surprise, Don Joe One Song is at the top of the leaderboard with 965,000 accolades. That's probably nearly the maximum amount of accolades you can get uh, in the game. Um, and also, another thing I want to show you before I forget, if you go in your accolades, you've got all of oh, these and check out categories. Accolade exclusive to the Hall of Fame. This challenge is only yep, you can just take said on. it. You're welcome. And if you head over, you've got obviously got all of these which were previously unlocked. If you head in here, you've got a special Hall of Fame, um, like accolades, back, sort of section kind of thing, with its own challenges in it. Um, and this is only unlocked when you reach the Hall of Fame. So here I have a prize of uh, that show business, uh, a Forza Link reward. And that's for winning every showcase. And then here I've got a reward of the Ferrari C 360CS. Um, for reaching level 50 um, and we've also got all of these rewards so you can see we've got a Dodge Viper here, Audi Quattro, Toyota Supra, um, we've got uh, Aston Martin Vin Vantage GT12, Aston Martin Vulcan, um, what else have we got? We've got Auto Union Type D, Sierra RX3, Locomotors Rally Fighter, Lexus RCF and I could go on so we've got all of these accolades to complete. We've also got this one here, which gets you the Koenigsegg Regera um, for completing all of them. So as well as all of these other accolades we've got to do, we have got all of the Hall of Fame accolades to do. So that's super cool. We'll, we might get a few of them done in this video. Um, but yeah, it's, it's, it's really cool to be in the Hall of Fame. It's, it's taken me two weeks, but I haven't been playing like in two sweat mode, I've just been playing kind of casual um, a couple of hours at a time. Um, so yeah, I'm quite happy. Um, we've reached it in episode 11 of our Let's Play series. If you want to see how I got here and what I've done in my previous Let's Play videos, um, then I'll link to the playlist on the end screen and also in the description for you to check that out. Um, and also, if you want to see uh, future content now we're in the Hall of Fame, uh, we'll kind of be stepping aside from our Let's Play series Moving on with more festival playlist content, hey, um, the season the actually fame, changes to today um, to winter, um, you can thank so you later. Uh, it changes at 3.30pm GMT, um, so I, c I can't remember when this video will release, um, but it might be just before or just after the season changes, depending on the upload time, because YouTube decides how long it's going to take it to upload, and you know, um, th things go like that. Anyway, so we'll be in the uh, winter season, um, so I'll be doing more festival playlists, guys. Obviously, I did a couple for autumn, like the Forzlan guide, the um, the seasonal stunts guide, but I'll be doing like full guide, like I used to do in Horizon 4, if you've been a follower of the channel for a while. Um, but I'll also be doing all of this online stuff as well. Um, so if you want to see that, then please do subscribe to the channel.
it really helped me out. I do also want to give a quick shout out to this wonderful um, person, I'm not going to mention his name, um, who commented on one of the videos, um, I think it was the Exploring the Map uh, number two video, um, saying how good my content was. He thought that um, my content was worthy of someone with a million subscribers, so I really do appreciate that. Um, these comments really do aspire me to carry on creating content and uh, yeah, I was, I was really shocked when I saw that, but in a very good way, so thank you whoever you are, you know who you are if you're watching this video, so thank you for that awesome comment. So if you want to see more, please subscribe to the channel, it massively helped me out. Um, but that is not the end of the video though, because even though we've unlocked the Hall of Fame, that was the main objective of this video, I want to do something to finish off, and I, I don't know what I want to do. I think, actually, I've got an idea. Um, so before I started recording this video, actually if we just pop back in here, after, before I started recording this video, um, it popped up that the, the Ferrari F40C was ready to collect, that was one of our barn finds that we'd been waiting for for nearly two weeks to be restored. So maybe we can check that out, toss in a few upgrades and to, uh, do, do a few races to celebrate um, us being in the Hall of Fame, I think that would be pretty cool. Um, so like I mentioned before, Don Joe won song is at the top of the leaderboard. It seems that you can't actually cheat accolades, which is really, really good. So Don Joe won song deservedly at the top, because he's uh, he's really good. If you want to check out his channel, then that is the name of his channel. I am just over a millionth in the world out of 10 million people, so I'm in the top 10%. I've got 210,000 accolades. Obviously, you can see all of these people have got the exact same amount of accolades as me. Um, so yeah, um, interesting. If I have a look at my friends list, uh, obviously Jaws at the top, then we've got JakeXVX with just over 836,000 accolades, then we've got Waz News, 830,000 accolades, then just outside the top 2,000 we've got Daniel Viola, we've got Wolf, Foxy, Dubs, Cold Palm, WRX Addict, Steve, I Love Fishy, Extasio, etc, etc. I um well, I'm quite far down the list. That's wrong, by the way, because Nick has way more accolades than that, because I've seen in his videos that he has way more than that. Unless he doesn't. He might not have, actually. It might be being mistaken for JakeXVX. Yeah, so I'm all the way down here. Um, so, yes. Well, I've beaten Jack Ultramotive, if that, if that counts. Anyway. Um, so that is the Hall of Fame leaderboard briefly, so now I shall head back to La Festival and collect the Ferrari F40. Oops, I didn't mean to click that. Ow! Anyway, I shall now uh, enter the festival. We shall collect our, uh, our Ferrari F40C, which is in here, and then we should do some, we'll do a few upgrades to it. So here it is, the Ferrari 250 GTO is pre pre prepping metal for paint, so I really don't know how long that's going to take, but anyway, the Ferrari F40 is ready, it's S2, it's rear wheel drive, it's the competizione version, so the handling's absolutely mad on this thing. So, I wonder if is. we make it an S2 I race car, go and take it for some races. Keys are in the ignition, enjoy! So, I'm going to toss a few upgrades on it, and I'll see you when I have done so. Okay, so here we are in our S2 blue Ferrari F40 Competizione. Um, so, I unfortunately had to make it all-wheel drive. Well, I didn't have to, but I wanted to make a proper competitive race car. I haven't really made an all-wheel drive race car yet in Horizon 5, so I thought I'd do that. Uh, I also swapped in the racing V12 which unfortunately makes it sound a bit insane, but if we, we have to do what we have to do. Um, and then other than that, it's it's almost maxed out actually, there's only a couple of engine upgrades I couldn't fit in without going into S2 class, so if we just give it a quick drive around now, um, the top speed's actually pretty good because I did a bit of final drive tuning. Uh, as you can see, the handling's also pretty good, it's better with rear wheel drive, but acceleration's not bad, it looks to be quite grippy, we might just have a bit of understeer, because we've got no power steering or we've, well, we've got a bit of all-wheel drive understeer as well. Um, but to put it to the test, 
Um, I want to take it to a race, and we haven't done many street races yet, so I think we should go and do this Costa Rocosa street race. We'll get ourselves some more accolades from doing that. Um, I don't think we've got like accolade bars to complete now, um, because we've got to the Hall of Fame, but we just keep adding to our accolades in the top right there. Um, so I've also shared this tune as well, by the way, so if I pop in here, and then if I go into tunes, um, I'll pop along to the right, um, where is it, there it is, so I've called it S2 road slash street, um, so we've got just over, well, nearly 1100 horsepower actually, which is pretty impressive, we weigh just over a tonne, um, and the share code for this tune is 905-486-798, or you can just search by my gamer tag Shiloh2017 to find it. Okay, so I'm going to head over to um, that race and I'll see you at the start line. Okay, so here we go, Ferrari F40, the race to celebrate us reaching the Hall of Fame and collecting our F40 barn find. Here we go, out of my way, Pony's Egg. We are coming through in our Ferrari. We're going to absolutely storm this race, hopefully. Although that regera has got some pretty good top speed, I'm not going to lie. Um, hopefully, though, we can use this uh, awesome Ferrari uh, competizione uh, handling to our advantage as we go into first place taking over from the unicorn uh, our brakes are also pretty good i just need to learn the course a bit more which would it would help although as you know i haven't really done many races in horizon 5 yet i've absolutely no idea where i'm going so uh lead the way hoonigan although actually i want to go in the first place so here we go absolutely send it around the corner like i expected we've got some bit of all-wheel drive understeer but Hopefully we'll get used to that in just a second. Um, at the speed we're going, we're going to be done like in literally a minute, which is pretty insane. Um, you can see the percentage and the time going up like an absolute rocket. Um, yeah, it's a really good car, this. I think we're some, uh, getting used to it. It could be quite competitive in uh, open racing um, and also just against the AI as well for some uh, accolades and race completion. Um, so hopefully, if we uh, if we master the the uh, car and the learning of the tracks, we should be able to do just that. Oops. Um, also, if you guys want um, want to let me know what you want to see next on Forza Horizon 5, I don't think I'll continue the Let's Play series now we've reached the Hall of Fame. But if there is anything in particular you want me to do as part of the Let's Play series, then of course let me know. Um, but really, I want to know what you want to want to what you want to see in general in Horizon 5. So, what cars you want me to customise? What you just want me to do? You want me to do tutorials on how to get money? Um, how to unlock the Hall of Fame, how to unlock certain things. Um, let me know because uh, it sometimes it's hard for me to think of ideas. Um, so if you let me know, then that would be greatly appreciated. I can produce the content that you want to see realistically. Um, so we got third place there, which isn't too bad. We could have done better. We just kind of messed up on a few of the corners there. But for our first race in the Ferrari F40, uh, and our first, what, what kind of our first street race, and Horizon 5, it's not too bad. Um, so I think that is going to be where we wrap up this probably final episode of the Let's Play series. But I do hope you have enjoyed this series. Um, and of course, if there is uh, any particular reason, I will continue this series. But obviously, it's not going to be end of the content on Horizon 5. I'll continue doing um, other videos. I'll, obviously, like I said earlier in the video, I'll do a tutorial on how to get to the Hall of Fame. Um, that'll be short, it'll be simple, it'll be easy to understand. I'll also start doing the festival playlist guys. And now I've got this out of the way, I can focus on the festival playlist. I can do guides on the, the championships, the Forzathon, the Horizon Arcades, the stunts, the online, the tour, etc, etc. I'll do guides. Uh, obviously I used to do them all in one in Horizon 4, but I'm thinking of doing them separately because it makes it a bit easier. I can edit them easier so they can be shorter and more useful for you so that you're not listening to something for half an hour. Um, so hopefully I'll be able to do that in the future. And to finish, we'll just spin this wheel spin. 
where we get yes yes the Pagani Wara BC Forza edition that is how you end the final episode of a let's play series so I really hope you have enjoyed this series guys and I hope to see you uh, in the next video on the channel hopefully I'll be able to get one uploaded for tomorrow but if I can't then I'm planning on doing a live stream over the weekend as well where hopefully we'll be able to get in a convoy do some online and um, get to grips with the Eliminator Horizon Open etc 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 so hopefully i'll see you then but if not then please subscribe to the channel and i'll see you when i see you so thank you so much for watching and i really do appreciate the support guys i really do mean what i say so thank you for watching and i'll see you bye